Hello, my name is Bobby and I am Wacky. Welcome back to another Wacky Fact Wednesday, week 61. 61, I gotta write that time. Let's just jump right into it. This week's topic is top five things you would take with you to a deserted island. Uh, and this is by Racks on Racks on Racks on Racks. It's, this literally his name. So, top five things you take with you on a desert island. I'm going to branch off of that and just kind of make the rules a little bit less controversial, okay? On this deserted island, there is a power source, there is cell service, there is food and drink. So we're leaving all of that stuff out of it. And we're just going with items that I would bring with me. First and foremost, obviously, I would, well, I'd actually bring my phone because my phone has a camera on it and I could still upload videos to YouTube using the camera. Um, and I'll include a charger with that too, but let's just, it's one item, a phone, okay? I could live without the rest of the phone part, but I'd still want to keep a YouTube channel, so I'd want <laughs> I'd want to record and post videos. Number two is okay. This is also a group of things. It's a, a baseball and a baseball glove and a baseball bat. Just just baseball, baseball equipment, basically. Okay, a, a ball and a bat is really all I need. A glove too, maybe. Okay, that is. Just give me just baseball. That's what I'd bring bring with me. Uh, number three is my PlayStation 4. That's the one gaming console I'd bring. If I had all the consoles, Xbox, PlayStation, Nintendo Switch, Wii U, whatever, I'd pick the PS4 because it's got the best games on it, in my opinion. I mean, Xbox and PlayStation have kind of same games. I'm a PlayStation guy. That's just how it is. So I take my PS4, and guess what? I wouldn't need to bring a disc because I have all my games digitally downloaded. Ha! Gotcha there. If you were trying to figure out what video games I'd pick, none of them because I got them all digital downloaded. Ha! So yeah, there we go. We don't, we don't have to worry about any of that. Number four, I would bring someone else. It doesn't matter who. Just, I would get pretty lonely and bored, and I think I'd die of boredom and loneliness if I was alone on a desert island. So, deserted island. Desert island. I don't. Whatever. Yeah, someone to talk to, someone to play baseball with, someone to play Fortnite with, you know? So I don't get too bored. Just pr bring a friend. Phone a friend. Bring... Say, hey, want to... Want to come to this d deserted island with me? Okay. So yeah, number four is is a friend, a pal, and number five. See, it's difficult because everything I you know I think of, it it really is all on my phone. Like I would say I'd bring a book, my favorite book, but I could get that on my phone. So why would I waste bringing that item if I can get it from my phone? Why bring a board game or a puzzle or something if there's an app on my phone that has that exact set? That's, it's just a digital version of that same board game, you know? Times have changed, man. You can basically bring your phone and have everything you'd ever want on a deserted island. We're getting back to, like, the, the most realistic thing when you're going to a desert island. A knife. You have to. How can you not? It's... Now, this goes beyond everything I was saying. Oh, there'd be a power source, there'd be food and everything like that, but still. It's got so many uses, you know, and if there wasn't... And if it was actually a deserted island, you could use that to... Depending on how big it is, cut wood for your shelter, cut... Cut open coconuts and uh, make a, a a fishing stick, a, a spear. It's got it's got so many uses. And if you're on a deserted island, I think you'd need 
a knife. So that is, that is my number one answer. So it was technology, 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 technology. Well, no, it was technology, technology, technology. Something that I think everyone would take with them to a deserted island. But in any case, that's going to wrap it up for this week. Uh, that was actually pretty short. That might have been the quickest Wacky Fact Wednesday so far since I started doing this again, like a month ago. Because previously, I used Bandicam to record all of my Wacky Fact Wednesdays. Bandicam, I didn't buy it, so I have the free version. So it had the watermark at the top, and it had a 10 minute time limit for recording your video. So, <laughs> and I wouldn't edit them, so I just do them in one take and make them under 10 minutes. So, this is like an old Wacky Fact Wednesday. Yay! Thanks for watching, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you have, we're going to be super duper very much appreciated. Other than that, I know it's kind of been spam of Wacky Fact Wednesday over the past few weeks. This has kind of been all the videos, for the most part with the one exception being yesterday, but, um, hopefully you're enjoying them, I know that, listen, I'm not stupid, I've seen the view counts, I know that not as many people watch this because it's not Skylanders and whatever, man, I don't care, I'm, whatever, I know the view counts are down because I don't do videos like that anymore, but it, Whatever, if you're not watching me, just unsubscribe like this. I'm making a video about that this weekend, probably, that you will you will see. Anyway, that, that does it for week 61. If you have suggestions for next, week top, next week's topic, let me know in the comments, uh, because I haven't been getting any, really, uh, and I think that has to do with the fact that no one watches these. But it's okay. It's whatever. It's fine. Leave a suggestion down below. Um, and I will, I'll, I'll see you guys in the next video, or it might be a live stream on Twitch, whichever comes first. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.